And she, if you make her mad, she'll let you know something, too. She got that for her mama. Yeah, she did. <laughs> 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 I remember one time, ladies and gentlemen, when I first just became sheriff, I was parked at the credit union here off uh, the boulevard. I was parked in the credit union, just sitting there with my windows down a little bit. And then all of a sudden, I had not talked to my sister probably maybe a couple, two or three days since after the election. It was back in 2010. And all of a sudden, I looked over to, to the right and I said, I waved to her. She waved back to him. She said, you. And she dropped some explicits. <laughs> that's what up a little bit. And she started having people thought we were about to fight. And that's how we talk. We talk. And, uh, and so I saw her now. She was coming down. She said, oh, so people listen to her. <laughs> yeah, everybody's listening to you. So I'm making myself sure she always, always fashion. Well, I remember I just started dating this uh, young female at school. And Shani had this pearl pocketbook that she kept back there in the back closet. I said to myself, I know she'll date me. Then if I give her this pearl pocketbook, I'll have this man alive. I got Shani went to the prom. She put that pearl pocketbook back there. And he might say, well, you still? That's not what well, you call it whatever you want. I'm trying to date. <laughs> so I got that pearl pocketbook and I handed it to, to school the next day. And he gave it to this uh, young female. She took it. Next thing I said, man, she still ain't working. Still ain't working. So then I went round as my mother called. I went into my mother's bottom door and got her way around. The teacher named Miss Stock, she popped the pecans. The, the female just ate all the pecans, so I was calling myself feeding. And then she took the ring. Well, it was so ironic about it. Next day, the pocket book was back at the house. The was back at the house. My mama didn't say nothing, and Charlene didn't say nothing. But Charlene, I remember going by, and we had a closet, and it had different colors, and Charlene, she said, I know you have a pocket book. And that's all I ever heard from you. So, like I can say, ladies and gentlemen, it's more memories that a lot of, again, we, you know, I, I read this share between her and I that, uh, that we've always been able to laugh about. But she was actually the first person I ever told when I first started dating. Man. I can honestly say before I told my mother and my father, I told you all <laughs> And I won't get in debt with that. But uh, again, thank y'all, ladies and gentlemen, for being here for uh, She's going to be missed because, like I said, she was always live. I uh, couldn't play space as good as everybody. <laughs>